This is the Army Today. Carmen Walker introduces us to a 90-year-old Korean veteran who fought in the war 60 years ago. On June 25, 1950, North Korean forces crossed the 38th parallel and invaded South Korea. The undermanned and under-equipped South Korean Army was pushed to the Pusan perimeter in the southern tip of the country. The U.S. military, along with United Nations forces, worked with the South Koreans to repel the North Koreans back across the 38th parallel. General Paik sun yuk was a colonel and commander of the Republic of Korea 1st Infantry Division when the war started. By the time ceasefire was declared July 27, 1953, he became the first four-star general in the ROC Army. The now 90-year-old retired general served as a guest speaker during a remembrance ceremony at the 82nd Airborne Division's Hall of Heroes. He gave an overview of the Korean War and shared some of the history of his country with the audience. 1948, Korea, South Korea, and the United Nations supervision first time general election. Korea, first time they are on constitution and on republic uh, of Korea uh, independent government. At the conclusion of the remembrance ceremony, General Paik was presented with a symbol of Fort Bragg, an Iron Mike statue. Reporting from Fort Bragg, North Carolina, I'm Carmen Walker. That's the Army Today, Washington.